Hey, how's it going everybody? Burnt Brian here and today I've got something sweet and tasty to share with all of you. My friend Kita over in Tickfa, Louisiana sent me an assortment of some of the amazing chocolates she creates over in her studio. Now she is the owner and creator of Sugar and Spice Chocolate Studio. I will have a link right here and again you can check the description on where to find her at. Uh, amazing products. Now this isn't the stuff you find every day in your grocery store or in a convenience store. Uh, not the crap chocolate. It's uh, actually good quality ingredients handmade by a great staff who cares about their products. Again, she is an entrepreneur and a self-starter. Uh, those are all things that I love. She's a local business. It's where my heart is. You know, honestly, I think a lot of corporations lose their passion and when they hand over everything to the uh, stockholders, it just, everything falls apart. It all becomes about money and not the product. Well, this is totally different. Unlike Hershey's or any of the other big brands, she actually uses quality ingredients and makes very unique treats to, to cover any kind of event that you're looking to cater. Um, definitely look at her website, check out her products, uh, send her a message, tell her I said hello, and uh, you know check out what she sent. I'm not going to go over the entire list of what she sent me right now. Um, you know, there's a picture at the very beginning where you can see some of it, and you can also go to my Facebook page to get a better description of everything that uh, she sent out to me. Um, but today I'm going to start with uh, truffles. This is something that's been uh, calling my name again. She has these awesome little boxes. They're all wrapped up with these nice little bows. Perfect for a gift for your woman, for your man, for anyone. Great little gift. Um, again, uh, let's see. I'm going to, I'm not sure which ones I want to try today. But nice little slide out top. Oh God, they smell so good. They all smell so very good. Um, let's see, I think today I'm going to go with the, uh, you know, since I'm a big spicy chili guy, I'm going to go with the uh, Mayan chocolate truffle today. Uh, again, I have a couple others that I'm, I'm going to look at. This is uh, dark chocolate with a hint of cayenne rolled in cocoa powder. Now, that sounds pretty awesome and right up my alley. And that's the big smell that I'm getting is that uh, cocoa powder on the outside. Look at this. I mean, this is huge. It's a nice, big piece of chocolate. Nice truffle. This is real truffles, not uh, cake balls rolled up. Real, real quality stuff. Mmm. Mmm. Excuse me for a minute while I uh, savor this absolutely delicious tasting chocolate. Right in the right in the back, you get a, a a strong hint of that cayenne. It definitely tickles your throat in the aftertaste. A strong chocolate flavor. Again, you're getting a lot of the um, uh, the cocoa the cocoa powder on the outside, um, and that wonderful chocolate filling is is just unbelievable mmm wow mm. this is very good um, again this isn't like anything you can find on the uh, in your grocery store or your convenience store this is um, very unique I really like how the back of the throat is is just tickled a little bit with that cayenne and the aftertaste it's not overly bearing or overly um, a present in the chocolate flavor itself. It doesn't take away from anything. It just adds such a nice little layer to it. That spice is a very interesting touch. Um, wow, this is wonderful. Thank you so much, Kita, for sending this out to me. I've got several others to share. Let me just tell you the, um, the other truffles that I'm going to be reviewing later this week are um, she sent out a pumpkin spice. Now, the fall season is coming around. There's going to be a lot of pumpkin, uh, pumpkin themed foods coming around. Uh, and this stuff is a, um, uh, let's see, it's pumpkin puree with spices and cream cheese dipped in white chocolate. Mm. Uh, she also has a lemon lavender truffle that she sent me. Uh, I've got some macarons cookies, uh, grandma's butterfinger crackers, and I've got pretzel, uh, chocolate covered pretzel rods. All kinds of amazing stuff. Please go check out our website. Say hello to her. Um, I'm really looking forward to trying the rest of these. Uh, it's taking everything I have to not just shove this in my mouth and stop talking right now. 
very, very good. Please check them out. Again, I will have the link down in the description uh, where you can find these delicious chocolates. Uh, please follow me on Facebook, www.facebook.com slash I'm going to put up a poll there later today. So if there's something in particular you want to see me review, that would be the place to go and put up your suggestions. You can also throw them down in the comment box. I'm always quick to respond to messages there. Um, but yeah, I'm not sure if you guys want to see a pepper. I've got a bunch of other peppers that just came in the mail too from T. Mutter. Uh, and I still have a couple left from Jim Duffy over at Refining Fire Chilies to review for you guys. So just let me know what you want to see next and I'll be sure to get it out right out to you guys. Um, so yeah, thanks for watching and as always, stay toasty my friends.